understand that you first met in the fall of 2014. And Cheryl, you were finishing up your senior year of nursing school. And Tyler, you were working those beautiful midnight shifts at the NYPD. Tyler, it has been 3,072 days since I became your girlfriend. <laughs> I have known Tyler for an extremely long time, like really long time. And during that time, he has always been quick-witted, funny, and known to have had an uncontrollable smart mouth. For those of you who may not know, I am only two years older than Cheryl. Naturally being so close in age, we would basically get the same things, matching toys and clothes, with slight differences to make sure we all know whose was whose. Before I start, I think we should just take a moment to really talk about the bride and the groom here. You both look amazing. We're all so happy to be here then that you invited us and let us be part of it. So everybody, let's give the bride and the groom a round of applause real quick here. Oop, upside down. Cheryl. The moment I met you, I knew that there were so many things that made you special. You care more deeply and love more fully than anyone else I've ever met. I'm so blessed to be the man that you have chosen to be the target of that love. As we grew into adulthood, I began to really see Cheryl for the person she truly is, the person she was born to be. Always willing to listen to a problem and try to remain neutral while offering her insight. Helping out anyone in need without second thought and never giving up when things were tough. Allow me to introduce myself again. I'm the one that knew you before time began. I've been There's no one in the world I'd rather share this moment with. I'm so happy to share this moment with you and to start this new chapter in our lives together. You are my best friend, my hero, the puzzle piece that completes me, and of course, the best papa to the boys. <laughs> today we start a wonderful and exciting future together. And today in front of our friends and family, I want to make you promises to always be there, not just when it's easy, to always be striving to enrich our lives together, and finally to be the missing puzzle piece in your life. I love you. We would like to open this ceremony with a symbolic gift of beauty and gratitude to two very special ladies. And that just happens to be Cheryl and Tyler's mothers, Belinda and Amy. Belinda and Amy, may I please have you come forward and stand next to your daughter and son. You've stuck by my side, encouraged me to never give up on my dreams, and always push me to be the best person I can be. There is never a dull moment for us. I always have the best time when I'm with you. You make me laugh, even if it's at myself. <laughs> and just the thought of you warms my heart and makes me smile from ear to ear. It always has. I knew the moment that I met you, you would be special. And I thank God every day for having you in my life. I promise to love you today, tomorrow, forever, and always. I love you. Allow me to introduce myself again. I'm no love. You used now, Tyler, to think do you choose Cheryl to be your wife, love, and best friend? And do you promise to stay to share your life with her? To respect, be honest, support, and love her. And will you stand by her side from this day forward for all the days of your life? I do. And Cheryl, do you choose Tyler to be your husband, love, and best friend? And do you promise to stay to share your life with him, to respect, be honest, support, and love him? And will you stand by his side from this day forward for all the days of your life? I do. Okay. Now that you have stood before me, in the presence of God, family, and friends, 
have expressed your desire to be married and sealed your promises with the exchange of rings and vows. Let it be known that you have agreed to be married according to the laws of God and the state of New York. I therefore have the honor and the pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. You may kiss your bride. Growing up, Tyler wasn't much for rules and was against pretty much any authority telling him what to do, like cleaning his room. Right, Amy? So I don't know if you saw Tyler's place beforehand, but Cheryl has made it look amazing. That couch I was talking about, it looks a thousand times better than beforehand. They give love and respect to each other each and every day. May they laugh together and be there for each other in the difficult times. May they grow old together, for the best is yet to come. Seeing the way they stood by each other just solidified the facts these two were made for each other. Cheryl and Tyler. I hope this day was as perfect as you dreamt it would be. Grateful <laughs> and relieved to see what kind of man you have become, Tyler. And I look forward to seeing both of you grow into a beautiful family. And, but I'm gonna raise my glass, and everyone please do the same. I'm gonna toast to Cheryl and Tyler. Cheers. I'm never going back to sleep